There are some truly gigantic animals in this world. The blue whale can reach 30 metres long and a newly born calf pops out at a whopping 7 metres. But this means it only expands by 4.2 times during its life. Even the Rothschild giraffe, the tallest animal alive, grows only by 3.3 times, from a 1.8 metre baby to a 6 metre adult. So which behemoth beast piles on the most pounds? Well, in Australia, the red kangaroo gives birth to a joey weighing just under a gram. But a large male can stand 2 metres tall and weigh as much as 90 kilograms. That's an increase of about 90,000 times. It's like a human baby growing to 306 tonnes. But that is still nothing compared to the ocean sunfish, the largest bony fish in the world. They hatch from a tiny, tiny egg, but expand at a phenomenal rate, reaching three metres in length and weigh over a tonne, an increase of about 60 million times. So we sent Sam to Monterey Bay Aquarium to meet Michael Howard to find out more about these supersized animals. How quickly do they grow? At times, it can be as much as 10 centimetres a month. You know, the Monterey Bay Aquarium has been um, working with this species uh, long before I arrived. One of their first successes, the fish grew close to 900 pounds in about 16 months. You have to sort of feed them quite a lot then? Uh, we do. Uh, depending on the size of the fish, we are targeting from 1 to 3 percent of their body weight per day. So Michael, why are these sunfish so big? They grow so big to avoid predation. So they just get big enough that nothing can tackle them? Really? Pretty much. I think so, yeah. You know, I would say their biggest predator at that point would be humans, you know, sharks and, and orca whales aside. What do they eat to get so big? In the wild, they're probably mostly consuming gelatinous zooplankton. So things like salts, uh, tinafores, and jellyfish. And those things are mainly water, so how? Yes, they're mostly water, in most cases about 90% water, and they're generally nutrient poor. Gelatinous zooplankton is often found in groups. So they can find a spot and, and settle down and, and have a good meal. I think that they're just eating truckloads. So if we grew as much as a sunfish, we'd reach 190 million tons by the time we got to puberty. For more animal facts, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time on Earth Unplugged.